what's on Jonah's sandwich? Looks like he's got mayonnaise, pepper, turkey. And cheese. Ketchup and mustard. <laughs> and he's getting some lettuce. Sissy's is looking nice over here too. We have a bologna sandwich with mayonnaise and pepper on it. Uh-huh. Ranch with celery and some of the cheddar, I forget what those things are called. Cheddar ranch. They're cheese Cheez it grooves. Yeah, cheese Cheez it grooves crackers. Uh, I have a yogurt. I just have orange ones. You want orange? Okay, orange. I like orange. You like orange? This is Titus's cheese case, y'all. It has all his singles cheese in here. What does the cow say? Mm -hmm. um, C. Yes. It starts with C, that's right, but how does he sound? Mm. Yeah. You want lettuce? Uh, one. Try one of those pretzels, y'all. Titus doesn't really like pretzels, but I'm telling you. Do you like you like honey mustard, right? You like honey, honey mustard? mustard? I know he does. I'm just wanting him to yeah, tell y'all. Like tell, 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 tell the I people like you like. <laughs> Folks, I like honey mustard, and I like these too. They are good, aren't they? Wow. If you, I'm telling you, if you Woo! think you don't like pretzels, Try those, you will like them. They that's are very really good. good. <laughs> yeah. I have a different flavor in them too, but that's my favorite. Let me see if I still have like some of the other ones. The kids must have eaten the rest of those other ones. And they tasted like, do you remember combos? The little pretzels that had pizza flavor inside. And the do you remember them? Pretzel. They're still out there. Are they? Yeah. I haven't seen combos in years. You gotta go to a convenience store, uh, baby, look on the bottom shelf. Uh, with dust, where the dust is. <laughs> Y'all, have y'all ever been into a convenience store and had dust? If you see that dust, don't buy a pack of gum in there because it's going to be crunchy. Mm -hmm. Titus will now do the tightrope walk up the stairs. <laughs> now we have some action going on. Would you like an alligator umbrella? Okay. <laughs> There must be some excitement at the green beans. <laughs> Look at all this green bean action. What? We've still just got the two tomatoes. That one's small and that one's big. Yeah. I think that one's a pumpkin. A what? A pumpkin. A pumpkin? Uh-huh. It's a mini beetle. It's walking on Susie's finger. So yeah, it's almost time to cook supper. Tonight we're having the summer corn burgers. It's not a burger made from corn. It's like a cheeseburger, but you make, like you know how you make Mexican corn? It's kind of like a Mexican corn salad, and you just make that to go on the cheeseburger with some lime mayo. Of course, there will be normal cheeseburgers for those who don't want that, and you put pepper jack cheese on it. <laughs> Black song. We're gonna start 
by cooking this corn on here a little bit. I just want it to get, you know, kind of dark in some spots. Just look kind of charred, you know? Kind of like it was grilled, but it's blackstone. Jonah and Sissy have come to smell. The, even the blackstone just by itself, when it starts heating up, it smells so good. <laughs> How we looking? Oh yeah, it's happening. It's getting good. Okay, I'm just gonna let these things keep going. I already have the hamburger patties made. I'm gonna go ahead and get out the other ingredients that we're gonna need for the corn salad, and I'm gonna make that first, then we'll cook the burgers. That way this is all ready to go when the hamburger patties get done, and we'll be ready to put it together. All right, for the lime mayo, we need one cup of mayonnaise. So some of this is gonna go with the corn, and some of it is gonna be left to the side just to spread on the burgers. Now we need one clove of garlic. A teaspoon of chili powder. Go ahead and start mixing that together. Now we need the juice from one lime. And these limes are very easy to squeeze. I'm just gonna squeeze this one instead of getting my squeezer. I'll use my built-in squeezers. <laughs> One tablespoon of hot sauce. I just have Texas heat here. A little bit of salt, a little bit of pepper. That's it for the lime mayo. It smells so good. Okay, we'll go flip the corn and start the burgers. We're just adding the lime mayo to the corn. And we can also put some cilantro in here. I think I'm gonna add a little bit of cilantro, but you don't have to. That's it. We're ready to make some summer corn burgers. It's a summer corn burger with pepper jack cheese. Summer It's corn. It's like a Mexican street corn salad on there. Oh, okay. Mm -hmm. There you go. I like the tang from the corn. Meat is seasoned just right. You know it. <laughs> He's acting like guy. I didn't even season the meat. I didn't even put anything on it. That's really good, y'all. I'm not joking with you. That is good. All right, y'all, we finished eating. I'm getting the leftovers packed up. We have three burgers left, and this is what we have left of the corn. Jacob and Tyler weren't here this evening. Jake went to a car show with some friends. Tyler went fishing with some friends, so I still went ahead and made them a burger. I'm pretty sure they're going to get something to eat and all too, but I have some if they want one when they get here. Anyway, this stuff, y'all, Titus was for real, not joking. This belongs on a menu at a restaurant, and I would call it just like summer street corn burger. That's what I would call it. It is so good. It's seriously, especially with those brioche buns. I used the, I think it was Nature's Own. Yeah, Nature's Own. Try this one, y'all. I'm telling you. It was great. The Summer Street Corn Burger. Do it. Can't find my lid for this, so I'm just gonna put some plastic wrap over it. And we're about to make ice cream, because it's the weekend. We're doing peach again. Mm -hmm. 